as you can see that it is saying that there are mistakes. Blue underline means that there is a grammatical uh, mistake here, but leave it like this. Like it's saying T, it's saying that T will be smaller. And the red underline means that it has um, mistake in its uh, spellings. You can right click on it and select the desired word, suggesting words, and click on anything uh, which is related to it. But we don't need it because it is the dummy text. Okay. So now uh, the text alignment. You can change the alignment of the text by just selecting the text and you can select left align, it is already left align, control L, you can center it, control E, and you can see that it is centered. Now you can right align it or you can press control plus R key or you can uh, make it justify or uh, equal okay just click on it or you can press control plus J as you can see that there is difference it is equal on every side but it is not because it is left aligned and okay next thing I will do is cut copy paste um, how can we use it? I already show you how you can um, use it. You can select the text, press Ctrl C to copy it, or you can go to home and click on copy and set the cursor where you want to paste the text. You can press Ctrl V or you can click here to paste it like this okay this is the easy thing or you can even cut it um, if I want to cut this text select the text and press ctrl x or you can click on this uh, icon to cut the text okay so now next thing is uh, format or uh, painter format the painter so or you can Format the painter. Um, home, uh, select the, click on this icon. They are all formatting like we we have bold this text, italic it, underline it, and if we want to format the text um, to its original form, just click on and click here, and you see the difference. Okay, now it's in its back form which was uh, its original form, okay? Now, uh, what is the uh, command for save as? As you, as I told you, the save command, which save key, which is, which was control plus S, and you can, uh, what is the key for, shortcut key for save as? You can click, uh, press F12, which is the shortcut key for save as command or you can go to file and then click on save as to save your file which i'll show you how you can save click on uh, press f12 and click on desktop where you want to save your file and give it your name desktop and click on save and that's it. Now, next thing is subscript and superscript. What is subscript and superscript? As you can, uh, you, you have seen that uh, formula H2O has two in, in small form and other are in big form. Like this, I'm typing here H2O. Make it bigger. So you can also see it. Now as you can see, you see that it's a formula for water. So 
it's 2 is still bigger and you don't know it's at 20 or it's 2 o okay just select 2 and you can click here it's to subscript uh, and you can say superscript click here to make it smaller click here to make it smaller but it's uh, top or uh, you can do this uh, by just clicking here and select superscript or subscript and click on ok and you can see that it is really impressive thing